Mikey Cat Outdoors here. So, what are we doing today? Well, I'm out in my uh, kitty condo, nut hut, whatever you want to call it, uh, man cave. So, uh, <laughs> just wanted to uh, show you a new piece of gear that I got. Uh, custom made. Uh, wow! Got the cat theme to it. So, yeah. Check it out, man. It's a... Uh, Custom printed Mikey Cat Outdoors bear bag in Dyneema Cuban fiber. And uh, a little snap there. And that little mesh area down there, that's actually an add on uh, spoon pocket. So if you got your titanium spoon, spork, you can put it in there and keep it cozy. And then uh, you got your regular roll top there. You roll it up a few times and Secure it and latch it onto your bag or uh, whenever you got secure, you put it up on a tree and keep all your fruit away from the critters. So, yeah, I got a couple other bear bags I've had and uh, used dry sacks and stuff before too for hanging food away from the critters. But this one's kind of neat. It's uh, hilltop bags and uh, you can get them all custom printed or they've even got their own comical designs there like a bear on a bear bag or... Uh, a groundhog for a groundhog steak bag, you know, stuff like that. It's kind of cute, but uh, this would be kind of easier to find if I'm in a group setting. So, yeah, check them out uh, if you're interested in it. They're not cheap, I'm going to say that. But, of course, a lot of Dyneema stuff isn't cheap either. Um, Price-wise, similar to like a Z-Pax type of Dyneema bag. Uh, so it's not too bad. But, uh, yeah, we can go from there. Oh, one other thing I want to shout out to, too. I got a uh, piece of gear here that I like to wear in the wintertime. Minus 33. It's the Expedition Weight uh, Merino Wool Hoodie. I've used this thing for a couple of years when I do night hikes at work when I was on thirds. And go out in the wintertime, I'd just wear this. And sometimes I'd put, you know, it was a little too cold. I'd have this and then I'd have my uh, down layer over it. And it kept me very warm. So, nice thing about this too, the wool, it's not really going to hold the stink, it's not going to hold the moisture, and, you know, if you're around fire or something, you got a little wood stove near you when you're camping and stuff, it's not going to melt like a synthetic, so, it's one of the things, but, uh, you can get these on my Amazon and stuff. Um, a little heavy, I don't know if I'd want to use it for ultralight stuff, but, uh, for what I do, normal, you know, backpack little in and out type of thing. It's good for that. So, yep, I'll uh, catch you around the other side. And uh, I'm not a drinker, by the way. <laughs> I'll see you. Thanks for watching.